So, Valley of the Drakes, another branching area, not very big. It's just for picking up these things and okay. connecting you to other zones. So, um, now that you know that, you've gotten what's here. It's a clean out, and it's for connecting uh, this door to the basin to New Londo, to Blight Town. Okay, so there's nothing I can do with this thing here. Nope. Okay, I thought, I thought. You're done with the Valley of the Drakes until further notice. Uh, I'm trying to spot the ladder. There it is. Ah, oh, it's tied to this thing. Weird. So oh, yeah. It's a rope ladder. Some zones are not full zones. Right? Some zones are um, just liminal spaces, we can okay. call them. So that's done. Um, what's next? What is next? So... Nah, I'll leave him alone. <laughs> I wanted to go kill the last one, but... For another thousand. It's okay, they, they won. They mentally won. It was short, but the Drake's won. So, I thought story of Adidon put that shit to rest. But if you say so. Uh huh. Um, I am near New Londo. Mm hmm. Hello. Greetings. Goodbye. Yep. You can, uh, you can New Londo. You can uh, tree zone bottom of light. Okay. Uh, bottom of blight. So warp. Go to blight. Quilag's domain. Oh, is it on the list? The chamber of the print. No, daughter of chaos. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Also, uh, a gentle reminder about feeding her humanity mm -hmm. whenever you feel like doing that. 24. Uh, it needs 30, no, right? No, you have 29. If you count oh, all, shit, yeah, it's true. all it's of your 10. humanity, yeah, it's, it's, 10. Yeah, it's, it's 29. And oh. you need 30 to get what you, what you need from her. Okay, well, that's that's interesting. What if I just went and bought one? Yeah. Or I could farm for one? If you're willing to empty out all your humanity and have no, no Kindles? Could it wait for the future? It can wait for the future. Okay, let's wait. Yeah. Let's wait. So. Uh, Back into Blight Town. To the far end where the trees were, where the slugs were. I personally don't like the idea of emptying out humanity yeah. until you have none left because an emergency kindle or um, l uh, being human to see cool things is sometimes required or useful so taking that away would suck yeah and I've been pretty happy with my humanities right now yeah so I would say um you know, starting with the next one, everything else. Like I would like, I, I would, I personally, I'm like, let me just have five for versatility's sake, maybe ten, um, and then going back and farming is always possible as well. You mm. know, but you don't, you definitely don't have to immediately um, feed her. Yeah. Let's keep them at hand for now. I would feel pretty sad if I had zero humanity on me right now. Um, okay. So it's the complete opposite end of the, of the fog. Of the swamp. Oh yeah, there was uh, the 
the lady over there. I could go talk to her again and see the pyromancies. Uh... Yep, the more you buy from her, the more she talks about stuff. You haven't visited her in a minute, so... Decent... ...thing to do while you're down here. Not to mention... Uh, once you're done with this... Check your covenant. If you're still part of the forest... ...protectors. Oh, shit. I was wondering if you caught that the rock was still coming at you there. Uh. Get down the tree. Ugh, right there. Everybody's taken care of around me. We can go to her. You're in the goop, but you can go. What's up? Ah, uh, it has been some time. Truth be told, I thought you had perished. Uh, a few times. <laughs> but let's not talk about You're that. You're okay. roam these parts, feigning ablution and pretending to seek answers. Pyromancy is the art of invoking and manipulating fire. But remember one thing. Always fear the flame. Lest you be devoured by it and lose yourself. I would hate to see that happen again. Okay. Um... Purchase items. Oh, I have a bit on me. I could get one. If you felt like buying something, yeah. Fire orb. Improves upon fireball. Better fireball, yeah. But, of course, whatever you buy must be attuned. Yeah. And what you attune takes away from... S other things. Primal pyromancy. The fire whip. And combustion. I have one. Great combustion. Point, Powerful flame. Point blank shotgun flame. Undead rapport. Charm undead and gain temporary allies. And the fireball. I thought that said undead rapport. <laughs> I'm not sure then. You're correct. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah. I wasn't good with combustion though before. No, you were struggling. I was terrible. You were thinking I that like, it, you, thought, you thought it was a fireball. <laughs> yeah. If you're down for damage, great combustion will be nice, but you have to remember to get in there. Point blank. It is not a fireball. Oh. Uh, oh, maybe I have souls on me. No luck. Hmm? I could just give no, a level up to my you must have my glove. But do not keep me waiting much longer. You can do that too. Yeah. She can take your glove to new heights. What's it at? Ten? Ten. Uh, you've been you've been actually casting uh, Great Chaos Fireball more than your 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 spells. Yeah. So, you know. Um uh, you three thousand. Oh I'll just pop the lowest one. Which should be this one, right? What does she need? I need 14k. Okay. Uh, well, I can tell you that uh, your large nameless soldier is 800. Uh, your proud oh. knight is 2,000. And your brave warrior is 5,000. Two and eight. I can just pop this two then.
the other thing to do uh, at some point uh, would be to discuss your boss souls. There you are. Yeah. I was expecting you. I have a bunch of them. Let us begin. Because I remember we did that with uh, Des, just a, a boss soul discussion mm -hmm. about what they can become and uh, whether you're interested. What is the max for the pyromancy flame? So, at first it was plus 10, but then it's plus 15, okay. and then she goes further beyond that, and Damn. new game pluses it. Oh my it god, okay. Because she's fucking cool like that. Now go. Whatever you do, do not crack and go hollow. I'll try. Lest my time spent on you be wasted. Thank you. Okie doke. Uh, still have the ring on, and it was on the other side, you said. Yeah, if you remember where the slugs were, you can actually see the branches in the distance. Yeah. Uh, eyes on health. One. Poison's not gonna, not gonna be that dangerous if you, if you just huff it. Uh, now, uh, if you stand in the in, in the safe spot. In the safe spot. Well, yeah, because if you're, uh, are you still a, a member of the Forest Covenant? Uh, uh, I think so. I haven't changed since, right? Well, take care of these these enemies first. If so, uh, you should be able to find a shop only available to people in that covenant down here. Interesting. Yeah, there's a couple things going on in this zone, actually. <laughs> Let's heal. We can even see one right now. Then status forest hunter. Yeah. So the elevator, which is uh, behind you. Oh, the elevator. Yeah. Uh, not this way. This is going. Oh, back. This is going back up. This is going shit. back into fuck. Fuck this! No! 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 Do you want? To, you really want to hit up the Gaylord Hotel? No! no I'm out. <laughs> when the, there's no cons, really? Oh, I could refill on Estus. You could refill on Estus. Yes, I know. Kindled. Yeah, we needed it. Out of the way. Yeah, so... Uh, just take a quick eyeball around here. Uh, I don't know exactly where... He is. Let's let's go kill that that last uh, little fucker over there. There he is. Uh, let me go take care. Yeah, of Yeah, sure. Don't get poisoned. Oh my god. Doesn't matter. You're gonna get poisoned. You're in blight town. Rich. I know, but I could have dodged it. I could have dodged you're, it. You're gonna. The, the previous poison went down, and there are two dudes here. That's a Jesus. Okay, who do I talk to first? I saw you first. So you get you get my Well you know them yet. Strange to meet away from the clan and the forest. But while you are here, how about some equipment? So I far away collecting these things. But I can only keep so many. And you know, you are a friend. I'll sell them cheap. Looks tower. What you got? Flamberge, Stone Greatsword, Demon Great Machete, Shotel, Uchigatana, uh -huh. Washing Pole, A Washing Pole, Demon's Great Axe, Claw, Demon Spear, East Wood Grain Ring. So, the Flamberge. Hold up, I'm just. So many noise all around. They're not coming to me, are they? You're just hearing the sound of poison right now. Okay. And the elevator and the dog doing work. So, Flamberge? 
This great sword with an undulating blade is the choice weapon of the slithering serpent men of Sen's fortress. This weapon is designed to flay the skin and causes heavy bleeding. Yep, 300 for the bleeding. Mm -hmm. And then stone knights who guard the dark root garden wield the stone great sword, a moss covered great sword. The same magic which created the stone knights is imbued in the sword. Unleash this power by wielding the sword with two hands. 40 strength required. Absolutely. And I'm going to take a guess that the description is indicating that uh, if you two hand it and press R2, it'll have a special attack okay. that does what they do. Yeah. I'm assuming. Demon Great Machete. The Lesser Capra demons use these great swords in pairs. The blade is cast iron and hooked. The sword is imbued with no particular magic, but for those who have the strength, its great weight will smash foes mercilessly. So he's basically selling you rare drops from bigger enemies. Yeah. And then the Chotel, the curved sword with sharply curved blade, created by Arstor, Earl of Ken. Check your life. You're good. Now. Uh, talk to me again. We meet again. I have the equipment if you have the need. What else? The Chotel, we already saw it. Uh, the Uchi. We have one of those. Thank you very much. The Washing Pole. A katana. They favorite. Katana forged in an eastern land, very unusual specimen with a long blade. The blade is extremely long, but as a result, quite easily broken. Drubble 60. 300 bleed. And, um... Well, if you go back to the numbers on it, uh, it actually needs strength over dex. Yeah. Can Usually, you uh, buff durability on the weapons? Um, by maybe by improving them. Maybe. I'm not sure. But I don't know. The washing pole. How about a, a hard fast rule on that? The Seems demon. like the answer is no. Okay. The demon's great axe, carved from the bones of fellow demons, wielded by the lesser Taurus demons. This axe is imbued with no special power, but can merely beat foes to a pulp, providing you have the strength to wield it. 46 required. A scaling. Yep. 114. Bludgeon. The claw. A weapon formed by three sharp claws. Attacks cause bleeding, and the wounds inflicted are not easily mended. The preferred weapon of the spooks of an eastern land. B scaling. Okay, okay, 6 and 14. 300 bleed. And then the demon spear. Which you already picked up, I think, and put it in the box. Carved in the bones of a fellow demon, wielded by the slim lesser batwing demons. Yep, chaos demons wandering on Orlando. Yep. Yeah. Imbued with lightning. And then the ring. Eastwood grain ring. This special ring crafted in an eastern land is made of gold, but with a wood grain crest on its surface. The ring slows the loss of weapon durability and is particularly useful to bearers of delicate swords crafted in the east. Such as a flimsy ass katana. And it would help with the crystal shit too? I would assume. Oh. If you're taking your ring slot. Um, yeah. It's durability increasing. All right. So you literally got the ring and the weapon from him to do that. This was the person that was hanging out yes, last time. Yes, in the back. Exactly. And so they're just covenant people um, that are down here that only appear if you're in the covenant while you're here. And if I change, they disappear. Yes. Okay. Um, when you go further into the covenant and level up, Alvina uh, basically says, I think that... She thinks Shiva's up to something, and that she doesn't really trust him, but she's not sure what it is. <coughs> um, Sorry. And that's about it. And you can you can come down here and you can buy stuff, and uh, you can, of course, there's always a ninja hanging out back where if you decide to get whatever he drops for you, then you're going to have to deal with a secret secondary person if you're not too uh, observant. Okay. You know? But, um, just for expanded lore reasons, 
uh, a, there's cut content in the game, and there's li voice lines that were recorded but never used. Oh, right. You can find them if you data mine or something. So exactly. So for example, uh, Oscar uh, is the name of the first guy that we meet, who gives you the who drops the the, the keys. Oh, okay. His yeah. We you never find out his name when you play the game, but his name is Oscar, and you find out because the cut lines have him actually surviving longer and going on. Uh, a good bit of the game adventure with you. Okay. You know, and uh, so on. With this guy, um, it seems that one of the cut missions was that he is supposed to be down here in search of the Chaos Blade. Now, the Chaos Blade is something you get by fusing uh, Quilag's soul. Okay. And you get a sword that is imbued with the power of super strong pyromancy, right? Um, and so he's after that, almost identical to the way that uh, the guy from Demon Souls was after the Makoto. Yeah. And he's, so his character was all essentially uh, an, uh, 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 an homage repeating that right. same thing, where if you were to have it, he'd be like, that blade, give it to me. And then you fucking... Uh, have to fight him to get it back, or not ha not give it to him, or do whatever you know. That that same kind of like uh, uh, he's after that blade, and if you show it to him or show up with it, he's gonna come for you to get it back, type of thing. But um, that was cut, so none of that is in the game. Okay. You can still get that chaos blade by making Quilag's soul uh, by 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 um, bringing it to um, the giant blacksmith, the giant one. Okay. At he, An Orlando? Exactly. He makes all the boss souls. But um, that's pretty much all there is for Shiva. He is, he's a shop down here, and uh, Alvina talks shit about him. <laughs> okay. And of course, if you decide to swing and betray, then you are going to, um, you know, upset that covenant. Mm -hmm. And you're going to have to deal with the two of them. Um, but in the meantime, if you do, he drops uh, Murakumo which is another eastern blade uh, as well as an oh, iron I got that one an iron round shield uh, didn't you get the Iado? yes yes yeah. I did yeah so it was a different kind um and um obviously you lose access to some of the cool shit that he sells if you happen to be interested in any of it let's talk to this guy there's nothing to say is there <laughs> Yeah. Still. So rare drop, rare, rare drop sales, right? If you don't feel like farming some of those enemies in particular, mm. if you want to get the, you know, like a Capra or a Taurus weapon or something, uh, yeah, he's good for it. Okay. And fortunately, all you gotta do is switch back to the Covenant when need be. Not bad. Yeah. All right. John Cena's not a fan of being addressed directly. <laughs> so. All right. Not looking at him then. Cool. So, um, over there is back towards Quilog. And then you were, you forgot your goal. <laughs> you were looking for, you were heading back towards the slugs. Yes. For the tree. For the zone. Yeah. I was, I look at this and I was like, branches? No, this is Quilog. So over there. Yep. So, uh, that dude is interested in katanas. He's got one, he sells one, and he originally was supposed to be scripted for one. Before you hit the slugs, however, uh, look around that, that area uh, across the bug. Because not long ago, there was a little something in the distance that you might not have noticed. Over there? Uh, look around. Yeah, just... No, not that way. I guess a bit further. There you go. Oh shit, alright, let's take care of these enemies first. Oh, 
Wrong target. Okay. Uh, may I go straight to him? Yep. Hey! Sleeping, standing up. He's thinking, Reggie. He's thinking. Oh, my B, my B. Mm -hmm. Oh ho! Excuse me, I was so absorbed in thought I just drifted away. You see, I'm actually in a bit of a fit. Oh, yeah. I've made it this far, but I'm short on antidote moss for the trip back. Antidote. Um, by my knighthood, I'm ashamed to ask, but can you spare a few scraps of moss? Fantastic. You can. Thank you. A saint you are. This knight of Katarina expresses his deepest gratitude. I shall not forget this. Please, take this. A symbol of my appreciation. Pierce shield, eh? Well, our fates do seem entwined, don't they? Perhaps this, too, is the will of Lord Gwyn. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice laugh. That's well, a good laugh. Good job helping him out down here. A poison swamp. I quick stand in there. Hmm. Tell me about it. The poison. There you go. Mm. You helped your buddy out. I don't know about you. I don't know about you, but I like the Onion Knight. He's pretty chill. He's pretty chill. The fact that he makes it, anyone who makes it to Anor Orlando gets respect in my book. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Made Straight it and up. Live. Straight up. Um, I, f I neglected to. Oh, yeah, go ahead and, and check this out. I'll, I'll talk in a second. Used in attacks with a large protrusion in the center. Can be used as a thrust weapon. And if you look at the attacks, it's 20 more than the others, usually. Yep. Yeah. And it's got a little stabby stab on it. Yep. All right. So, you know, it's a, it's a function shield. If you want to poke, poke. Um, cool. I neglected to mention that uh, the uh, Shiva drops the stuff I told you to, that he drops. And his bodyguard, the ninja, drops a ring that gives you a special kind of roll. If you happen to be interested in that. A special kind of roll. <laughs> oh, well, now I'm curious. I, I didn't want to kill them, but... It's the trade-off if you're going to not buy anything from him. Uh, you will get... I'll just tell you. You'll get a ring that gives you uh, acrobatic stuff. Shit. I think you might have just killed him. Yeah? I think you did. <laughs> I think you just killed, uh -oh. killed a man. But you have to sacrifice a ring slot for it, mind you. Yeah. But if you wanted to see it, certainly... <laughs> okay. This is so savage. I'm going to kill that's, a man for something I might not even use. That's a drastic enough thing that you're interested in. A different role? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of want to see it. Okay. All right. Oh, my God. I guess we're fighting. I I, I mean, you you weren't... I, I, admittedly, without that piece of information, your incentive judging wasn't even. No, I was like, ah, oh, that's fine. We can live. Yeah. But now, oh my god. Back to the elevator. With an equip weight of under 25%. Oh. So I need a fast roll. You need a fast roll. Which we need a respec of everything I have. It turns your fast roll into a faster roll. Because it's not a roll at all. Take a look at the shop again. Yep, I, I still want it. <laughs> I think you might have killed him is a, <laughs> is a funny way to say that. He's by the elevator, by the way. So yeah, it's at the, across on the other side there, right? But just don't trigger the, the, the rock guys if you go too far.
Oh, boy. <laughs> I mean, if this happened with the first the undead shopkeep. Oh, right? he was so dead from the moment I saw him. But I but it wasn't until I mentioned that he dropped stuff that you even thought about it. Like they all drop stuff, right? They all drop stuff. Exactly. So like for that but that guy, he had it coming. In some cases what they drop is unique, in other cases you can it's not unique, but it just it's harder to get. Some people drop stuff that you can get via covenants, for example. If you play a bunch of online covenant things, you'll get this reward. Or if you kill this guy, you'll get it. Type of thing. So this guy in the back, right? Would, in fact, be the one. Um, but check the shop again, like I said. Just to confirm. I've called my best picks from my last summoning. Have a look. He's cool. Before you... Okay, well, just I don't want the ring. Okay. And... I don't think I want any of these weapons. They are farmable from the enemies, they imply. Uh, the claw and the washing pole. Uh, I don't know where else to get them. If you can. But, it's... It depends on whether you 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 no would want it no not interested no all right okay. also of course that ends the that betrays the covenant and um and then I'm not friends with the cat anymore exactly so covenants you can switch and come and go to but, but if you betray them but if you betray this one like not all of them but some of them are betrayable right if you betray this one then you're you're not you're not coming back. Unless you pardon it by paying for your sins. Which, oh yeah, and I, I was wondering last time if I had sins, right? But can you pay for sins after killing an NPC entirely? That's the, that's, I, I guess you can. I don't know. Well, okay. Well, I already made up my mind. You sure did. Right in your face, right, right in your. F I'm so sorry, dude. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Y'all are cool, but I hope you're ready. Did I just whiff? He didn't even finish his line. <laughs> What were you saying? Big baby. What were you saying? Mighty Miracumo Iron Round Shield. Let Close me, up on Big Baby. Let me flex on him again. Like, oh, guess that was nothing. Goo goo ga ga. Boss baby. Dark Lord Crane, Crane Ring. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. Are you? Covenant? None. Out. You're out. Out. You're not cool anymore. So now that whole forest area is a fuck. Yeah, you are no longer part of the mob Piru. 6th Street. 55th Street. <laughs> Alright. Forest Crypt Blood. Kings. Dodging that whole neighborhood now. You Dark can, wood. You can try throwing up the gang signs, but I don't think it's going to work anymore. <laughs> This special ring crafted in an eastern land is made of gold with a wood grain crest on its surface. Agents of subterfuge, subterfuge fuge, in this faraway land are particularly fond of the dark gold wood grain, which greatly alters its wearer's rolling actions. So, I need... You can look at the shield too, even though that's clearly not what you care for. The Iron round. Iron round shield. 172 fire. Thick iron shield of Shiva of the East. Heaviest of the standard shields deflects enemy attacks a famous specimen from Shiva's collection, but none who have faced it have lived to tell the tale. Anything else unique about it? Uh, let me just check something. Mm. Yep. Doesn't seem so. Looks pretty, but that's about it. 
I know you're not a numbers guy, but but well, always, I'm looking at them yeah, right now. Always, always well, um, go back and it, it, you just you you blow past it very quickly each time, <laughs> and it's like sometimes there's stuff there that is unique that you won't know otherwise for sure. Uh, yeah, cool. Nothing, nothing, nothing to say. Um, well, get I naked, mean, put the ring on. It seems. It seems good. Oh yeah. So if you're trading up, like trading fire for magic and lightning, what well, one point of lightning? But it's still, I mean, you're currently not wearing like your current ma currently your magic and lightning are are not a, not the factor you're yeah. wearing the shield for. So. Okay, so. If I replace this, are you trading it or not? Trading? Are you switching shields? you It looks like you were considering it. Because I was it, considering it. Well, because it ha it does have a better it does have the uh, better stat. Wait, I'm sorry. No, fire is what you're currently equipped for, and it's currently better on what you have. Never mind. Um, I'm silly. Okay, so... All right. Get naked, put the ring on. Do your thing. Yeah. How is Square. my equip load? Yeah. Oh, I got chest. And you're human, so it looks all right. So, is that how it looks like? Really? No, that's a cartwheel. That's a cartwheel. And you're back on your feet. Oh yeah, take it off. Yeah, to see the fast roll. That's fast roll. And you can check different directions as well if you're uh, exactly. Uh, well, if you're holding. Uh, well, what, actually, no, you have to be locked onto something to side roll, back roll, etc. Yeah. Don't kill him. And then just run away, put the ring on. Run away and put the ring on? And then test and then the test rolls it. again. Okay, let me just... Yeah. Try to be quick about this. Flip, 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 flip. Oh, this is cool. Speed. Move. That's so yeah, that's so smooth. No recovery. Speed, iframes. I think iframes. I hope so. And that's what you get. I should practice to do that in real life. Um, yeah. I can sure. do a sideways cartwheel, but not a front cartwheel like that. That's fucking crazy. Reggie. <laughs> Look, man. We're getting up there. The chest. All right. Amazing chest. There's no shame. Oh, I got hair? Mm. There's no shame and not reclaiming what you used to be able to do as a kid. If you say you can still do a side cartwheel, I'll believe you. I'll just ask when the last time you did one was. Less than five years ago? Okay. Maybe in a park at a, at a, at a, at a, at a picnic, I think. Well. But it's been a while. I can try one after the stream for you if you want. Are you familiar with Tom Segura? Yes. Did you see him play basketball? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh yeah. He, yeah. He was remembering things, and he got on the court, and he got he got hurt. He thought. <laughs> he thought. <laughs> and his bones had something else in mind. <laughs> and I'm not looking to drag you out of here <laughs> by the arms, that, you know into a fucking ambulance, but, uh... Dude, I can still do a cartwheel. Uh, you know, a lot of people think they still can because they did one and they remember doing oh it. Oh, my God. I used to walk on my hands, dude. Oh, that's crazy. I was... I used to literally do a handstand, balance, and walk down the hallway on my hands. I remember what that felt like. It was cool. That's crazy. I, uh, what, I'm gonna sit here and tell you I can still do that? <laughs> dude. 
Ivy. I, I still believe. I still believe. Yeah, apparently it, 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 you need to. At the beginning whatever, of the pandemic, whatever it asked is, me, can you still do a pull up? I'm like, yeah, I can do a pull up. And then at the end, I was like, nope, I can't. Clearly, you still believe because you need to. And something inside of you needs that. So let's not take that away. <laughs> just spend the re just go ahead, live the rest of your life out believing that you can do it. Oh man, you know, I'm going to go out and I'm going to do it and I'll send you a message. I can still cartwheel. Why? That's what's going to happen. Just record the video. Okay. You want to record it? I'll give you first view. Live access Reggie, to Reggie I, being a badass. I do not want to be responsible <laughs> if, for okay, if something bad happens, setting the splints, bones, <laughs> and various other things that happen, especially if they happen on my property. If they happen, you can just drag me by the leg outside. Just tweet, just you put it, put the put the phone on the table. <laughs> do it at home. Tweet it out. <laughs> All right. Check out my Twitter. It's but gonna, really, it's coming out soon. But really, I I'm I don't <laughs> want you to do this. This is not me encouraging you to do wow. this. Wow. If you were doing it, that would be the way to do it. But I'm telling you, I, I'm not trying to tell you to do it because I really don't think you should. Because I don't want to see you get hurt. Okay. Yeah, I'll try not to get hurt. It's that's, in my best interest for you goal, to just right? not do this. I would rather you do an announcement. I'd rather you look deep inside yourself and just, you know, it's okay, man. It's okay. All this all this lack of confidence from you in me. Just putting fear in me now. I'm like, am I gonna break my wrists? <laughs> like, am I gonna twist my arm up and miss a week? Oh no, I can't. You know. I wa I'm not even saying that you are incapable of ever performing one again. I just think at the moment, <laughs> in our pandemic states, <gasps> combined with our age, but I could be wrong. Well, now I got something to prove. You have something to prove. I'll take the L if I can't. It's more than an L. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so, uh... By the way, the internet doesn't care about your broken bones and twisted ankles. They welcome it. They just want content. <laughs> they came to the NASCAR race hoping that you would steer into the wall. They're not here to cheer on for you to win the race. They're here to cheer on you crashing into the wall. <laughs> Don't forget just, it. Just fun. Uh, was this the way? Yeah, it was. Oh, yeah, and then we broke that. Thanks yep. to this. Yeah. That's exactly it. And then the Great Hollow. Might be me in the future. Yeah. But there's a pathway. If you started working towards it, practicing slowly, you know, getting more fit, yes. getting more in See shape. See if I can do a push-up. Yeah. There's a pathway towards it. For sure. It's just a cartwheel. Jack LaLanne. Look at him. He fucking, you know. It's just a cartwheel. Right? I hope. I hope. Oh, yeah, and we came here, but now we can explore. It's going to take more preparation at this stage of the game than it would have in your youth when you had some armor on. <laughs> That's all. That's all. This is not a, this is not a, it can't ever be done. This is a, in your default state, mm, it's, it's a fucking big risk. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't bet on it, and I wouldn't take that risk. But with dedication and preparation, if it's what your dream was to do, then you can do it. But right. it, you have to, you have to fucking 
be sure what you're doing. You have to dedicate your time into being like, all right, my goal is to now take this body and make it do a cartwheel. Oh shit. Two twink. Oh my god, it left. It gone. Yeah, lab if you lab it. If you lab it, <laughs> you can do whatever you need to do. You know? <gasps> oh, there's a lot of shit here. Fuck. Yeah, this is a new zone. And there's a bunch of twinkling shit everywhere. Sure is. And the moment it notices you, it's gone. Oh boy. Okay. This is not Blight Town. This is a new zone that requires new zone attention. Oh, there's a passageway here, which leads to the middle of... Nothing. I would have put something in there. There's stuff everywhere. It might not be obvious, but... Aha. Chunk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's stuff everywhere. Sure is. Okay, see you. Uh, oh, I'm gonna need to jump. Oh, geometry. You're playing. You're playing ice climbers for a little bit. I mean, that wasn't really... You could have just... Done something else? Yeah, that was a little dramatic, but... Well... <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, there's something at the other hand. At the other end over there. So this branch below... Can I go from the other side? Are these walkable branches? They are very thin. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I can fall on this. God. Is that it, scary? No, there has Okay, let's take a simpler path. Let's go around. What, what other games would consider a mistake in platforming, this game embraces and designs a level around. <laughs> Jank dropping from one surface to another. Okay, let's go down to this one. Thanks, Miyazaki. <laughs> That's not a branch. Let me go. Oh my god. Is that a hole? If it, if it's not a hole, then it's not a hole. Oh, I can't go. I'm too fat. Let's try fatty. Okay. Sometimes it's just a lie. Whoa! There was some jank there. Let's just fall. Something move. Oh no! I'm sorry to let this happen to you. <sighs> yeah, I remember what they do. Good shit. Cool. Nicely done. Yeah, I saw the big old eyes and I was like, uh-oh. I've seen that before. Once, not twice. That was weird. My weapon went through it, so I was like, did I discover something? Okay. What, was, what, what the fuck? Branch, branch. Oh my god. A little scary. Uh, ah, this goes up. Uh huh. Oh no. Asoko. Wait. I saw an item.
Okay, let's go back to see where it was. 